Hi Leo, the Awakened Dreamer here to give you a tarot reading for your next 48 hours. Thank you so much for joining me. Do keep in mind this is general for uh, the next two days for you, but uh, as well I want to thank you in advance for your likes, comments, and subscriptions to the channel if you haven't done so already. Now also do keep in mind this is meant to pertain to the following 48 hour period for you, starting around when you are guided or drawn to this reading, not just following when I post it, okay? But as well, um, stick with me till the very end of this reading as we're going to do something new and pull a couple uh, charms to further speak upon the next two days for you. But we're going to start by pulling some um, Oracle uh, one or whatever we get from the secret language of uh, light deck and then from the good tarot deck to further speak upon the next two days for you. Uh, if you're new to the channel, I'm a Leo Sun, so I get you. Both of these decks are new, to, uh, new excuse me to my collection so i'm excited to put them to use so let's begin i'm hearing good energy good energy i feel like you're in good spirits positivity floating around in the air you could find that you are given an opportunity or multiple in the next two days to uplift others okay or to help other people in one way shape or form or both for my lovely leos for the next two days for the next 48 hours okay all right we have two here we have light beings yeah i feel like you're a light worker if you were drawn to this reading um a star and a lot of we's spirit's gonna whisper to you okay you could also hear over here whispering you could be thinking about gossiping for one reason or another even if it's not present in the next few days for you i do feel like you're pushed to recognize um even the small uh details of your routine uh, or routines rather that help you shine like the star that you are okay uh, being a, a light being a light worker however you want to view it um, means you need to cleanse your energy take care of oneself and it just reminds you that you're on this uh, earth uh, given this life to um, help other people while helping oneself okay but we also have color here um, it just feels like a colorful next uh, two days for for Leo and I just feel as if you're pushed to recognize what's making your days feel more colorful I feel like you're reflecting a lot thinking about uh, a job situation or certain connections It could be a multitude of things that you're thinking about reflecting upon in a positive light There's a reminder in the next two days that you have a huge heart I mean, it's one of our traits that we're known for having such a loyal heart sometimes to a fault but I feel like it, it shines through in the work you're producing, developing, even conversations you're wrapped up in, okay? There's a colorful way about you that is attracting what you desire at this time. Beautiful start. We're going to put this up here um, since they're different. Uh, they face different ways. Anyways, let's pull some good tarot. I'm hearing you're on your way to stardom. You're on your way to stardom. There's also thoughts about astrology, the universe, thinking about your own little universe, um, your connection to others, I wanna say again. For my beautiful Leos to continue. Okay, do you wanna flip? We have star at the center, okay, the star card. I truly feel like there's a level of healing taking place in the next two days. It could be from all the work you're producing, developing, you could find that you're helping others heal um, and or simply healing through the work that you're producing and developing. There's a sense that they're showing me um, a, another star card in the small everyday tarot where there's two cups, kind of like the traditional um, imagery, where there's two cups um, being poured out in different directions. I feel as if there's a, a helpful nature about you once again, pouring into the cups of others. Um, stardom is what I'm getting again. There's a colorful reminder coming through from spirit, even potentially the universe through other people, um, that you need to keep the hope alive when it comes to a wish you desire, okay? It could have to do with something you want to leave behind, sail away from, all right? There are a lot of benefits on the horizon for you in the upcoming months, I feel the need to say. I know this is about the next 48 hours, but the next couple months, few months, wow, a lot of rewards for you. Uh, they're saying monetary gain. Your connection to the moon will take a relevance in the next 48 hours as well, okay? They're saying get a good night's sleep. 
as I do feel like it, it's going to benefit you on a multitude of levels, your digestion, your stress levels, even though I don't feel like you're super stressed, but I feel as if there's a lot on your plea. So it's, it's important for you to get your rest, okay? Take a nap if you have the opportunity to do so, as we have the hanged man here. I feel as if you're pushing other people to change their perspective or better understand something, okay? You could, and specifically, excuse me if I could speak, uh, you could be getting a push from spirit to readjust your own perspective, but it feels like you're helping others, okay? Your tree of wisdom being put to, to use, your knowledge. Wow, okay, I need to take a deep breath as I do feel like you have a lot going on. We also have the five of air. I feel like spirit could be stressing out at certain points or other people could be. There's a need to keep the hope alive. Because we have a dove right there. We also have transformation here. You're going through a transformation to say the very least and it's beautiful. It's a colorful one. People are noticing a difference in you. If you found that you recently have run into one or multiple people you once knew or saw more in the past it, i feel like that's going to happen more so moving forward they're seeing the transformation even um even if it's just a partial realization uh, okay or just they're seeing parts of that transformation i feel like more is happening behind the doors than you realize they're making me add this up the number four coming into play if you look up the spiritual um meaning or the angel number meaning whichever you feel most guided to as we have the four of air I love when that happens and I'm noticing the peacock feathers right off the bat and the very angelic presence about you at certain points. Okay, they're saying there's an angel watching over you. I feel as if you don't need to force it to show off. You don't need to force it to show your feathers, to sh show your true colors, to, um, to be a, a shining star, right? It just comes naturally. I feel like the words that you speak are just so damn powerful. They are relevant, they're helpful. They're helping you move towards what is meant for you. Change is on the horizon, my friend, as I feel you already know that and are desiring it, manifesting it all the meanwhile. Think about it, it comes to be. That's what I'm getting. Think about it, it comes to be. Your manifestation skills, your intuition, heightened at this time. There's a reason why I was meant to wear the crown uh, ring that I added to my collection and the feathers. Are those feathers? Yeah, feathers symbolizing spirituality, spirit communicating with you through uh, nature, animals, you name it. Uh, don't be surprised if you see a feather in the next two days, but there's a royal-esque way about you, okay? Put your crown on, Leo, keep it on, as there's a lot to look forward to, okay? Um, a call from spirit to put your gifts to use, your skill sets, right? I feel as if you're very spiritually connected, even if you don't fully realize it. I'm getting a very judgment card vibe uh, about this imagery where you're being pushed to be honest with others, honest with yourself. But more importantly, just get your voice out there, create, develop, communicate in the way you do it best, right? In the way it feels natural for you. As I do feel like you're gaining a key moving forward and you may be researching or gaining more clarity on just that in the next two days because your world's changing, my friend, okay? Your world is changing. They're saying faces, okay? You may be thinking back to when you saw a lot of faces. You could be seeing faces in weird um, places. Uh, it's spirit, okay? It is spirit. We're going to take this as well and just keep pulling. All righty, two of fire. Definitely a focus on your fire side, but because you're a fire sign naturally, but all the other placements as well. And simply what you lack what you desire where you want to travel where you know you're meant to be in one way shape or form even if you don't have it all figured out you don't you don't need to know it all in order to move forward is also coming through okay i'm gonna take this one ten of fire okay it feels like um things need to complete in sort of in certain ways in order to start fresh that you could feel as if you're putting on a show at certain points but Things do feel a bit heavy in certain ways, while in other ways it's very angelic and light and fluffy, okay? Um, I didn't know why I just said fluffy. But anyways, um, the queen of air coming through as I feel as if you're pushed to think about what needs to be cut out. How are you going to use your wisdom, your knowledge to um, benefit oneself, the future of your situation as well? As I feel like at times you're so focused on making money, helping other people, growing, in that sense, even growing a business or your career in general. I just feel like your eyes are on the prize, my friends. Your eyes are on the prize. 
Um, somebody in your midst has a very cold presence, pay no mind, as I do feel like you are learning more about who you're meant to be in this lifetime, what you're meant to achieve, and gaining information, knowledge, research, again, about a future change, um, potentially an investment. Let's pull from the center. King of Fire, beautiful. I do feel like there's a bold, fiery confidence about you. Um, in the next two days, there's a focus on how mature you've become over time. Uh, maybe feeling as if you are not very youthful in energy these days, even though it does come to be occasionally or come to the surface, I feel like the spirit's pushing you to remember how much you've changed in a beautiful way, how much you've grown into a mature individual. Okay, you may feel as if you're an old soul if you were drawn to this reading. Look at that heart. Okay, again, a focus on your big Leo heart with the Ten of Earth. It just feels like you're on your way to, they're saying stardom, financial gain, a financial comfort, stability, a focus on how your world is changing as you make money along the way, okay? Make a difference as well. Beautiful reading. Let's finish this up by pulling some charms. For Leo. So we're gonna go with this. Beautiful, we got a Hosma here. I feel as if it's just a huge um, focus on your transformation, my friend. A huge focus on your transformation. Oh, look at that. Uh, a connection to nature. Okay, we'll put that over here. They're saying feather again. Feather. You're going to see a feather in the next uh, two days. Again, your spiritual connection. Butterfly speaking once again upon your transformation. A bold one as we got, I think, the biggest butterfly in the set, okay? Um, look at that. We got a crown, of course, for Leo. Um, as I said, that really weird. Don't be surprised when you're spoken to in the next 48 hours. Um, let's pull one last one. Beautiful as we have a coin. I truly feel like money is on your mind and you're gaining stability moving forward once again. It's going to be a powerful next 48 hours for you as things transform uh, by the minute, all right? Manifest what you desire and keep the, the energy positive. Keep your vibration high, okay? It's gonna be a great next two days. So I hope this was truly helpful. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Go have yourself an amazing next two days and I'll see you next time. Bye, Leo.